bring it over. And Charles, you're going to want to be obviously over here. Okay, so now we're going to carefully set it in, kind of get it sort of lined up. Lift the front, bring it down even. And that's what we were trying not to do. <laughs> okay, let the back set completely. Just let the back settle in. <laughs> if it hasn't, lift the front back up till the rear settles. Okay, now once, I'll take this. Yeah. Once it settles, okay, carefully set your rods so they don't smack down. Okay, and this one, if you rotate the crank a little bit, stop right there. This one will set like that and just carefully lay this one over. Okay, so now we can just take the bearing here. I'll let you guys hold that again and locate it. So we got our reference marks and we're going to use the, now, never like this, always like this. Okay, so our reference marks aren't quite there yet. So we lift up the front just a little, rotate it, okay. There we go. See what happened there? I rotated and just thunk and pulled the bearing together. That's how you set that, okay? Once it's set, don't lift it up again because it's gonna move, okay? Now, I'm gonna lift it up and make you do it. I gotta, so now that it's back to where it was, now you guys can go ahead and try practice setting that. I mean, if I do it, it's one thing, but you guys have to be able to do it. So rotate it first, lift the front up. Rotate the bearing until you're close. No, that, that, that's it. Okay, it looks like you got it. Yeah, Try going the other way too. Yeah. Use, the, use the screwdriver on the front side to see what moves. Okay, so it's good. Now you're going to take the other case out, pick that up, and flip it over to set it on. So it's a three-person job. One to get the rods, two for the case. Flip it over. Okay, now you have to keep it exactly even back in front, because remember you have a stud do we have all your rings in there? Yep, you do. Okay, so now put your, grab your, before you do anything else, take all your bands out. Carefully lay the rods so they don't hit something. Make sure you don't tie it when you take them out. Can I get those out of there? Slap one. Okay. I have them tied, didn't I? <laughs> Just leave it there. What's that? Just leave it yeah, in there. Yeah, it's an extra five horsepower. Nice one to get to. Can you get down there? Let's rotate the crank. Rotate the crank, there. You got it? <laughs> if you have to, just pull it hard enough and snap it off. There we go. Okay, so. Now, put your torque plates on. Where are they at? Here they are. Just the top two for now. And that's mainly to protect the case from the rods. Utah. Okay, so before anything else, grab your plastic hammer. Where's your plastic mallet? Nothing's in the right drawer anymore. Okay, I see. Okay, now you're going to hit it. Here, here, here. All the way down until it seats. Keep going. Yep, right there is good. If you hit in the center, that's fine. Okay, just keep going until it's completely seated. Okay, so 
with this type of a case, that's a good sign. Crank still turns, the bearing's still in. With this type of a case, this isn't going to do any good. Don't worry about those, we want the through stuff. Put the nuts back on the back to put a little bit of buildup oil on the stuff. Just, just a dab on your fingers and just wipe it on the threads. Just on the through so studs in the back. Just like that. And then put the nuts on this. Just the back tube. We, do, we gotta put the through studs in here and here. That's the next process. Now for you guys, it's completely different than everyone else. Because of the because of the dab. So you're gonna put your nut on. Just grab one of the through studs. Yeah, grab one of your through studs here real quick. So the front ones here are relatively easy. You set your threads like about that. You just go like this. That one's good. And when you put the front front plate on, you put the knot on that side and you it from this side. Okay, so you do the same thing. Now, normally we put some oil in the center here. But in this case, it doesn't do any good. It doesn't make any difference. Literally, the case, see in this case. Ah! Wow, I got a chuckle out of Charles. <laughs> All right, so the other two, put your nuts on deep enough that you have this much of the stud sticking up. Okay? And just drop them in. And then the next thing after that is put your torque plates on, grab service instruction 1029, and start snugging things. Okay? 